friends. Today we have a very fun lesson. We are going to learn when to use in, on, and under. These words are very important because they help us know where things are. Let's start with in. In is used when something is inside. Like when I put my hands here inside, you can say that my hands are in my pockets. How else can we use in? Where is the cat? The cat is in the box. Where is the ball? The ball is in the basket. You got that right! How about this? I have my lucky coin here and I want to make sure that it's safe. Where is the coin? The coin is in the pocket. Very good. That was easy, wasn't it? Now, let's learn about on. On is another special word like in that tells us where things are. On tells us that things are on top or being worn. When I wear my hat, it's on my head. Let's go through some examples until we get the hang of it. Where is the apple? The apple is on top of the elephant. Where is the t-shirt? The t-shirt is on the boy. Let's try some more. This is fun! Where is the pillow? The pillow is on the bed. Where is the bow? The bow is on her head. Good job, kids! Now, let's learn how to use under. Under is used when a thing is below something else. We'll give a lot of examples of this so that we can learn. Where is the mouse? The mouse is under the table. Where is the bunny? The bunny is under the tree. Where is the shoe? The shoe is under the bed. What a fun lesson! Now, let's try and see what we learned. Try and see if you can fill in the blanks with the right answer. All you have to do is look at the picture and choose from these three. In, on, and under. And fill in the blank with your right answer. Are you ready? Let's start. The apple is... The plate. The apple is 
on the plate. Very good. The monkey is the cage. That's right. The monkey is in the cage. The mouse is the bed. Correct. The mouse is under the bed. The candy is the jar. The candy is in the jar. Very good. The baby is her lap. That's right. The baby is on her lap. The dog is the tree. Correct. The dog is under the tree. Good job. Practice some more by looking around you and see what's on, in, and under. Until next time, have fun learning and Bye! If you like this video and want to watch more episodes of Read With Me, don't forget to subscribe to I Am Learning and click the notification bell. You can ask an adult for help if you don't know how. I hope to see you next time, friend. I'm Learning Lisa and have an amazing day!